Hello friends, welcome to the 43 episode of Joomla 2.5 custom component development series. In the previous episode, we have learned that how to create the JTable instance and we have created our JTable instance. In this episode, I will show you how to perform different operations using that table instance. So, let's start. So here we are in the text controller and we have uh, just fired up our J table object. So now I will show you one by one operation. So from this object we can get the table name. So get table name. So if you want to get table name, just use that object and type get table name. So let's save and refresh. So here we you can see that our table name print underscore r okay so you can see our table name now if you want to get the primary key of that table which you have mentioned in the j table that is here if I change this um, like primary key also there will be change so I will show you so get the table primary key so get key name save and refresh so here you can see the ID is the key of the table like uh, if you mention the user ID so if we use that user ID is the key of our table so like here if we mention save and refresh our controller that is test controller so here you can see the key is changed so from a particular J table instance we are able to get the table name as well as the I key name ok so let's change back to ID now we can get like uh, table column names so table column names so get fields save and refresh so here we can see one is id column type is int is a primary key auto increment and or the privilege user ID here is the message column date and time and ordering I have added uh, later to explain few things so let me delete that one so here we can see all the fields list from that table so in this way we can get all the fields from a particular table name so let's change the table name to another table let's say menu types or menu so here underscore underscore menu save and refresh our controller so here we can see lot of fields there so in this way we can get all the fields now let's take a look at the menu ok now ok leave that menu let's check menu there is order type publish component checkout image no so thanks for watching this tutorial and uh, in the next episode I will show you how to perform create read 
insert update delete operations into your database table using that J table. So please subscribe to my channel and if you have any questions suggestion please uh, write your comment below this video. Thank you.